spaces to take part in the big lunch. It's an event which encourages people to have lunch with their neighbours. Among them was the Duchess of Cornwall, who joined the in the trade bridge in Wiltshire for the party. And the weather generally bright and dry this evening, with mist and fog patches in northern England and southern Scotland. That's the BBC News at three minutes past seven, our next to date. BBC Thank you. First of all, to the A73 at Newman's. It remains closed following an accident earlier today. Closures in between the A71 at Newman's and the turning for Cleland. The M6 at southbound. There was an accident earlier, south of 33 at Colgate, towards 32, which is the M55. Now, all lanes are open, but there's still very heavy traffic moving through that stretch. Further down, the M6 southbound, junction 20 to 18. So, really, from the limit to change again to Holmes Chapel, there was a breakdown and there was an accident earlier. All cleared out of the way now, but again, you've still got very, very long keys heading through there. A55 eastbound but west of Connors Quay. There was an accident earlier just past the 52A. That has now cleared off the carriageway. However, very long queues behind that. There was a seven mile queue stuck behind it and say that's all moving through now. M25 queues and clockwise. It's heavy 16 M40 to 11 at Chertsey and then clockwise from 5 M26 through to 7 M23 and then again it's heavy between 9 and 10 leather head to the M3 and again from 15 M4 to the M40. The A2 at Gravesend, the westbound exit slip road for the A2260 to Ebbsfleet is still closed. There's an accident earlier. It means that the diversion and can't use it. The main carriage went down now being affected. And then to the A30 at Salton. It's been closed both ways. There's an accident between Salton Cross, the A386, and the A388 turning for Paulston. And thank you for your updates. Keep those coming back now, just after 8. <laughs> Hello my lovelies, welcome to Sunday Night with Michael Ball. It's just gone 7 o'clock, which means it's time for our number one. Hey, Jude. 